What's up guys? Skyth here, with a little update video for you. Now, uh, first thing I wanted to let you know was, uh, Alan Wake's American Nightmare is going to be starting pretty soon. Like, uh, in the next couple days. Sometime in the near future. Uh, I actually have to download it still and install it from Steam because I'm lazy and I haven't gotten around to it. Mostly because I've been playing the game in the background, which is DayZ. It is amazing. Like, it's fucking awesome. <laughs> it's really one of the only games that I could, you can truly call survival horror. Like a lot of games these days, like the last one I could think of, like Amnesia, off the top of my head, and that was like a year ago. So, <laughs> yeah, it it's freaking awesome, basically. And uh, I kind of wanted to do something on it, like maybe if there's some interest in in doing a playthrough of it, but not a traditional kind of playthrough like I've been doing because as I've been playing it I noticed that 90% of the game is like running through fields and not doing stuff, well maybe not 90% but like 80% a large portion of the game is nothing and there's very little action but the action that there is is great and there's always tension but I don't think that would come across well in like a video like running by a road you never know if like someone's going to walk by but you don't really you can't really get that from just from watching it, I think. So if if I did do something, it would be like every couple of days or maybe once a week to, uh, like, so I could have time to edit out all the boring stuff and just leave in the action and all, all the good meaty, meaty kind of situations. Uh, what I really should have done was recorded all the stuff of me learning the game because for the first few days I had never played Arma 2 which is what this game is a mod of. And so I didn't know how to use the inventory system or anything like that. I was completely clueless, and it was probably the best stuff that <laughs> I could have ever recorded. But, you know, what they say about hindsight. I didn't record any of it, and now I know what I'm doing. As you can see, I've got some kind of nice gear. So that's... It took me a, quite a while. I've actually been alive for a little bit on this character, like six hours, I guess. That's how long I've been alive. I don't actually have any reason to be in cities anymore. I'm just going because I'm tempting fate. I could just live in the forest if I wanted to. I have everything necessary. But it's kind of fun to, uh, you know, tempt fate every once in a while. I haven't actually run into any players the entire time I've been playing this guy. Like, they're there. I know there's at least 20 of them on the server right now, I think, that I'm playing on. But, you know, yeah, I, I play on like 30 to 40 player servers. I never see anybody. I, it's probably a large factor as to why I'm still alive, but, you know, you know how it is. When, when you play this game, you don't really run into people all that often, I've noticed. But when you do, like, it's trippy, because you never know, like, what are they going to do? Are they going to, like, try to kill me for my beans or something? It's, it's intense. Totally intense. Love this game. It's basically, let, I'll, put, I'll put it this way, and I'll sum up everything I just said. Which, kind of, I should have done first. That would have made sense, but I don't do things that make sense. That's just how I roll. That's how I roll. So, uh, I would say that it's basically everything I wanted Dead Island to be when I first heard about that game. And, like, the very first things I was hearing, like, oh, it's zombie survival on an island with an open world. And I was like, boom, I wanted it to be this game. <laughs> but, so you can imagine kind of my disappointment when I actually played Dead Island. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't very good either. I would never play it again, really. <laughs> like, I was kind of bored with that game halfway through it. When all, I found out it was side quest the game. And, uh, yeah, so this game, though, it's freaking amazing. I love it. It's definitely a, a good game to play with friends, like, to play co-op. But me being the forever alone guy with, <laughs> with no friends, uh, I'm just kind of playing it solo for now. But you can do that, too. It's totally fine. It certainly adds to the tension when you don't have anyone nearby, but uh, it's it's great. I, I should probably shut up about it, because this video is mainly made to just tell you about Alan Wake's American Nightmares coming up soon. Uh, ask if there's anything you... If, if you'd be interested in some DayZ stuff, just every once in a while. And uh, also Skyrim's DLC expansion DLC thing. I'm not sure which one it is. Dawn Guard Star? Dawn Star? A guard? I don't remember what to call it. <laughs> like, that's the thing. When, when games come out that I really want to play, I really don't want to learn anything about them. Like, I try to learn as little as possible. 
But basically what I, I did find out is I think there's vampires in it. Like, it it's a, centers around vampires. And if that's true, uh, then that kind of puts it in that area of uh, kind of almost horror, possibly. There's monsters in it, so it sort of counts. And um, I'd be interested in doing a playthrough of that if there's uh, no objections. Because I'm going to play it anyway, and it would be really convenient for me if I was doing a playthrough at the same time. Yeah, it's kind of my ulterior... ulterior? I cannot say that word. Or ulterior motive there. <laughs> so that I can actually play it through and beat it. And not have to, like, juggle time just to fit it in there somewhere. But anyway, that's... If there's no... Like, there's no interest in it, then I won't, I won't do that. But it sounds pretty fun, that's for sure. Anyway, just want to let you guys know why I haven't uploaded any, any Alan Wake lately. It's because I've been wasting my time in DayZ. Uh, excellent, excellent mod. I highly recommend you play it if you're into zombie survival games. But really, who isn't? I mean, that's why this game is so popular, right? <laughs> Makes sense? So, uh... Till next time, everybody. Thank you for watching. Uh, I will see you in Alan Wake's American Nightmare. That's not the button to stop it, is it? Stop. Stopping. I am saying stop. Stop you.